So uh, this first piece is a tribute to all the sisters who are um, infected with this disease. And uh, oh, awesome! And so uh, this is a tribute to them. HIV. Statistics say that I represent almost 70% of this pandemic disease. I have died over and over again. You came, you came to my funeral with tear-stained eyes, horrified that I died too young. You told my story incorrectly. You slandered my name as if my spirit could not hear your lies. You destroyed my integrity. The community rejected me. The church didn't want to deal with me as my family stayed away from me. All around this country, ignorance destroys my integrity. I am not who you say I am. I am a queen, Coco Brown and rich dark tones resembling the darkest night. I nurtured, I nurtured hungry black babies from swollen and cracked nipples. I placed in my children the keys of life. My sons built the pyramids. I ruled nations. Strength and wisdom surround me like sunsets backdropped against African skies. I have been beaten, belittled, branded, bloodied, bombarded, and labeled a bitch. But like Lazarus, I will rise. I may have I HIV. I may be laughed at and my story distorted, but I'm still a conqueror. I'm still a winner. I'm still a survivor. There is victory in my tragedy. Tragedy is nothing new to me because I have hope, faith, and trust in divine love and love never fails and love never dies so don't call me the new so don't call me the face of hiv call me queen call me beautiful as i ride the wings of love because love never fails and you better believe love never dies